Y'all make sure y'all hit that like button, man. Hit the like button, man. Don't go no further than this video without hitting that like button right now, man. Hit the like button. And subscribe to the channel. So, the CEO jizzle situation get worse. Um, it's a lot of speculation. I decided, let me make a video on the speculation. Everything we're going to say in this video is alleged. Glorilla, let me holler at you real quick, Glorilla. See, um, I think I knew what you was trying to do. I think you was trying to distance yourself from some things. But you did a live stream. And a lot of people are calling your live stream federal. Why is the live stream federal, King AK-471 and only voice of the streets? Because in the live stream, she kept asking who got shot, who got shot, who got shot. Her phone muted, the live muted for a second. It unmuted. And you can hear somebody telling her, the dude who took Migo chain, right? Migo, CMG Heavy Camp. Everybody know who that is. She asked again. You know who that is. Then she's like, what happened, right? So they explained it, dude explaining the situation. He said, I was right there. A witness to the shooting. <laughs> Admit, like, hey, Glorilla, uh, 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 Glorilla, can we highlight the person you were with, please? He was witness to the shooting. So uh, he get to explain it, how, you know, everybody was on the side of the stage. Then he get the name and who was all on the side of the stage. He said it was the paper route, niggas. He said all type of clicks. Then he said the CMG. And then she said, I'm on live. But the live kept going. And a lot of people was was, was calling out Glorilla because why would you even go live? You know, what was the point of going live? And it could be multiple reasons, but we not going to speculate. We just know from her live that you had paper rock niggas there. You had CMG niggas there. Don't mix. You feel what I'm saying? So, you got to know that paper route got, you know, who they affiliated with, CMG, who they affiliated with. Now, this could have went all the way left. You feel what I'm saying? So, a lot of people is asking, how the hell did CEO Jizzle get shot inside the arena where the Memphis Grizzlies play? There's no way you could get through that arena. Somebody had to sneak a gun in. So now, because people thinking people either snuck a gun in or was allowed to wink, wink, pay a couple dollars to get a gun in, that it might have been a setup on CEO Jizzle because CEO Jizzle was going live, letting people know where he was going to be. You feel me? And that could be the perfect time. Oh, he going to be in there? Hey, man, I got this for you. Let me get this hammer up in here. You feel what I'm saying? Now, a lot of people said it was more than one gun shooter. It was a couple shooters. Who cares about that? So, you got to ask yourself a question, though, because this is another rumor. Black Youngster Brother is the dude who got killed, right? Dude who killed him, they are already from the same hood. Well, y'all know black youngster old hood don't mess with them. So, in reality, black youngster brother died in, in their own hood. The hood don't mess with them no more. But a lot of people noticed that black youngster's old hood was starting to form ties with paper route niggas. You feel what I'm saying? Um, Grove Hero, who's able to drive over there frequently. Nothing happens to him. Um, it's some other guys. So it made people ask, hmm. Could this have been retaliation for Black Youngster Brother? What I'm answering is, I don't know. If you have that question, who knows? Because it could be retaliation for anything. Don't forget, he took Migo Chain. Black Youngster Hood already, uh, old hood already aligned with Paper Rock niggas, so it could be, shit, we gonna get him. And then y'all gotta just know, Jizzle have done a lot, man. That boy is hot, man. You feel what I'm saying? I ain't finna get on here and say what all that boy done. He just know 
He damn near snitched on himself. He damn near called himself a serial killer from the, 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 the bed, the, the, the hospital bed, bro. Man, I done took all you niggas, as many of y'all out. I'm like, bitch, what you talking about? You feel what I'm saying? But what I can say, though, it could have been that they set up just to get him. Why nobody else got shot? Yeah, Jizzle swung on somebody. But he the only one that got popped. All them gunshots. Looked like all them bullets was put into him. He went by himself. So if you want to get a couple niggas, you could get a couple niggas right there. You feel what I'm saying? Jizzle was dropping his location, letting people know he was going to be. Shit, the wrong people pulled up and knew you was going to be in there. This situation is a hot mess, man. <laughs> but all the rumors that I just bought to y'all is all with people DMing me and what I'm seeing on social media. So I decided let me just make a video about it because it is, you know what I'm saying, kind of crazy. Now, the crazy part is, can't nobody dispel none of these rumors because Glorilla live stream, buddy told who was right there. So, this not police, this not federal. Bro, paper out niggas, CMG niggas. So whether KSBG was with them, they all moved together with them. That day, we heard it from Glorilla Live. So it's like, what, what was the purpose of that live, bro? Because now people know who shot Jizzle. Well, no stranger. And if they did know who shot Jizzle, now Glorilla Live, or some dude just told the whole world, like, damn, the paper rock nigga was on the floor. Oh, my Jesus, man. <laughs> you can't make none of this up, man. So a lot of people was pointing out Glorilla lie. That lie was kind of crazy. I ain't get it. I don't know if she was trying to distance herself, act like, you know, I don't know nothing. I ain't got nothing to do with nothing. And in the same time, you captured a nigga explaining everything that happened to the T. Um, but like I said, man, it could have been for anything because we now know the participants. Could have been for the chain. It could have been on site because of what this nigga been doing, including the chain. It could have been black youngster brother knowing that the hood niggas aligned with these niggas and now y'all ops and everybody ops together. And, you know, I just find it mighty strange how in the live it said paper, paper route niggas and CMG niggas was all there, but only one nigga get hit. CEO Jizzle, man. <laughs> I think you just got spared, man. I think in a weird way, you was targeted that night. And they was going to make sure they got you, whether you swung or not. Y'all make sure y'all hit that like button. Y'all make sure y'all subscribe to the channel. Y'all make sure y'all share this video, man. Let me know in the comment section how y'all feel. And don't forget, hit the like button, man. Hit the like button. King AK47, Voice of the Streets. I'm out.